For me, these two pictures perfectly sum up one of 2024's biggest tech dilemmas. Fake images and videos created with generative AI flooding the internet and our social media feeds with severe consequences. They have become so ubiquitous that they are being used in election campaigns in the US and elsewhere. Donald Trump shared this fake endorsement post on his account on True Social in September, right in the middle of the US election campaign. Trump and his team most likely chose the AI-generated image of Taylor Swift, knowing it would make headlines. After all, Swift is one of the world's biggest pop stars and spoke out against Trump many times. And while this image looks a bit cartoonish, other images shared by Trump look much more realistic. For example, these pictures of fake Swifties for Trump that Trump shared on X. X, by the way, is the perfect place if you want to find AI fakes, because fact-checking and content moderation teams have largely been eliminated there. And the platform's owner, tech billionaire Elon Musk, is sharing AI fakes himself. Like this depiction of presidential candidate Kamala Harris. Talking about Musk, his face and likeness is being used by cyber criminals for AI investment scams. In late summer, fake Tesla live streams started to pop up on YouTube. In them, a fake Musk made an investment proposal. The AI-generated Elon asked users to scan a QR code and transfer cryptocurrency. He also promised to pay back the double amount. This has become a rather common strategy. Criminals take existing material, in this case what looked like footage from a Tesla event, and alter it with AI software. They can change what is being said in the video and even alter faces. The damage caused by AI deepfakes is predicted to reach $40 billion in the next three years. And that's in the US alone. Some scammers take it a step further and don't just steal celebrities' likeness. In January, Hong Kong police revealed that a finance worker had been tricked into paying nearly 25 million euros to fraudsters who used deepfake AI technology. A criminal posed as the company's chief financial officer in a video conference call. Unfortunately, it could happen to you too. In early 2024, Chinese authorities warned of scams where people were tricked during video calls. They believed they were talking to a friend or relative and were then asked by the criminals to reveal sensitive information. These schemes have been reported worldwide since. Video generating AI is getting better at a breathtaking pace, which also adds to a problem that has been existing for a while. Deepfake porn. This year's most prominent victim, Taylor Swift, again. Fake porn content with her likeness flooded the internet, getting millions of views. What's especially problematic, even though there have been attempts to block and delete the clips, once something is available online, it's nearly impossible to take it down for good. But it's not only celebrities that are becoming the target. AI revenge porn can nowadays be easily produced by an angry ex. And fake nudes have been used to extort money from teenagers in so-called sextortion schemes. Worldwide, countries are working on laws to make the creation of sexually explicit deepfake images a criminal offense. For example, England, where relevant steps were announced in April. According to help organizations, teenage sextortion cases are surging in the country. South Korea criminalized watching or possessing sexually explicit deepfakes in September. A global report on deepfakes from 2023 states that South Korea is the country most targeted by deepfake pornography. The impacts of Gen AI on our lives are real. So what can be done about it? The answer is, for now, we have to be more skeptical towards images we see online than ever before. You can sometimes spot visual inconsistencies in AI material, but the technology is getting more and more convincing. Apart from that, so far, social media platforms have not found a way that can reliably identify AI content. Meta started its Generated with AI initiative this year, but the algorithms they used were not precise enough. Even photos that were hardly digitally edited were labeled as AI. This caused backlash from photographers, who feared their work would falsely be given an AI label on Instagram and Facebook. So stay alert and all the best for 2025.